Well, my mom's in a wheelchair. <laughs> 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 from all the dick anyway i walk in the bathroom he's at he's standing at the urinal facing out and he's pissing out of his fruit basket in the urinal and everybody that walks in is just like jesus christ i'm a cum slut you need to have a, a good sized prick to, to pull that off In premium, or if you have linked your premium to Discord. Well, you're muted. In... You've been muted the whole time. Shut up. Nice track. <laughs> the... Hello? Yazinator? Are you there? He called in twice. Yazinator? Yazinator? Yazinator. Yaz? Yes. Are you there, Yazzy? You play the Yaz flute? Uh, but you can, I mean, you can see. If I go side profile here, you're, I mean, you're, you're really, I mean, I'm, I'm grabbing that, and I'm not even sure if that's It's not moving. Less. What's TOS? I'm not even sure if this is TOS or not, but I mean, you can see there's. What I mean, is there's TOS? You don't know what TOS is? No. Hmm. <laughs> What's TOS? Why don't you just try to guess what it is? Is it an acronym? Yes. TOS? Are you Googling it? Tits or shirt? No, I'm taking timestamp. Tits or shirt? <laughs> That's a good guess. That's a good guess. I'm not sure if it's against TOS to do this is the sentence I used to do. Oh, oh, I thought you said I'm not sure if this is TOS no. and you were squeezing. If this is against the terms of service. I got there. There you go. Here I literally go. thought girls peed out of their butts until <laughs> the middle the middle school bus and kids were like, dude, no. I was like, what? But they don't have they're like, no, there's just Jesus. a different hole. I was like, no. No, Middle but look, I, I, I tried to teach this girl a trick that I know when, uh, well, I was four years old. Uh -oh. I remember trying to trick, uh, teach this girl a trick how to tuck so you don't have to hold on, you know, hands free. And uh, so I'm like, all right, so just tuck your PP in right there. And she said, what? I said, uh -huh. Where's your pee -pee? She, she starts freaking out. I don't have a pee pee. Yet. Oh my god, it's the gone. Student, we gotta go look for it. We gotta go student, look for it. The student it becomes off the somewhere. I think I had it at recess. Where the fuck did it go? The student becomes the teacher. She was the greatest tuck oh of all time. Oh my god. Wait, you tuck your dick to take a piss? Oh, it was a trick I learned. I scooted forward. I could go hands free. You know, I could. And then you pee out, out the. Day. And then you pee out the back. That's called a fruit basket. Oh, hey, there Emma. you go. Oh, wait. There you are, my baby is it girl. Alive? How old is that dog? I hope so. Oh. Yeah. Oh, yeah, she's alive. Shit. She lives. She's pretty. How old is that dog? <laughs> she is about seven along with this one. Oh, she's aging well. Oh, shit. She's oh, blind. Shit. She can't this see. one's blind? Yeah, she was. Uh, Hey, babe. <laughs> is, there, is there an actual female in this house? There's no way it's a female. I think she left. <laughs> I, I she got cigarettes eight good, years ago. Yeah. I'm going to get some milk. <laughs> this is my big boy. He's a he's a Belgian Malawak. Jeez, you run a shelter? A zoo over there. God damn. <laughs> Here's my tiger is next. Those, those are my babies. How do you have time to reverse jerk off on the toilet with all these animals running around? How much peanut butter do you go through a month? <laughs> <laughs> okay, I've got one. Are you ready? It's not cheating if you spread peanut butter all over your testicles and let your dog lick it off. Oh, oh, because it's your dog. Jesus Christ. So a fruit basket is when you shove and your you frank, it? you shove your frank and beans, you tuck it, and it sticks out the back. You can, it's all facing that direction. All right, it looks like a basket of fruit. I got it, yeah. yeah. We're in this bar. There's a line even for the men's room. I'm waiting in line. I see my buddies ahead of me, but whatever. He goes in. I'm, I come like four people after him. I walk in the bathroom. He's, at, he's standing at the urinal facing out, and he's pissing out of his fruit basket in the urinal, and everybody that walks in is just like, Jesus Christ. Like everybody, like half the people that crack it up, the other half of the people were like, "What the fuck, bro?" It was honestly like a very memorable. And you were just busy I, taking I will, pictures. I there are <laughs> there are pictures. You need to have a, a good sized prick 
to, to pull that off. I've got Marcelo Golm in this one here. I think he gets it done by submission later in the fight as well, by like third round. By James. Oh, that's a big oh, shot. But God is done. Dark, high light, real fashion. Interesting. Yeah, the, moral of the, the, the moral of the story is I'm just going to... I'm just going to keep eating and drinking, and it's fine. They'll fix me. They'll throw a piece of plastic in. Have you go. ever had an enema before? Of yes. course not. Really? Why would I have an enema at, at anywhere under 60? Oh, well, I had a lot of issues as a kid, so I had a lot. Of, I had scopes done, so I had the privilege of having an enema done. It's a, it's a wild experience, man. I was like 12 years old or something. They just shoot water up there to clean my it all out, right? Yeah, my, I had, had my, my, my mom do it. <laughs> Oh, you do it at home. I had to do it the night before surgery. You do it at home? Well, I had to do it the night before surgery, like or the morning of surgery, like completely clean it out. Dude, okay, the worst part on, about that. I'm, I'm gonna need. I'm gonna need. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Oh, Jacob's skinny and weak, and and everything he eats upsets his tummy. You go to the doctor. The doctor's like, all right, we gotta shove a camera up there and see what's going on inside. We're gonna do that on Thursday. Wednesday, Mrs. Lines, I need you. To shove the garden hose up his ass and clean it out? That's part of the what? process, yeah. And um, the, I'm like, Mom, get the fuck out of the bathroom. <laughs> First, I had to get the full jar of stuff that makes you shit. I mean, the whole, like, the liquid, like, uh, x I mean, it's basically x, x lax but yeah. this was, I remember it was lime-flavored, so it was very fun to drink. <laughs> I had to drink the whole fucking thing. So, literally the whole fucking thing, as, a, like, a little kid, because they, they want you to be completely cleaned out, like, literally completely cleaned out. Of course, because otherwise they're shit, and they can't see right. what the actual guts so, look like. Um, so, I had to drink all that, so I'm just shitting my pants, and once you're finally done, like, you feel like you're finally done shitting your pants, like, the next morning, you have to do an enema, and I'm a, I'm a kid, so I'm like, I can't, like, figure out how to stick this, it's just a little, like, a little squirt bottle thing sure that you out. fill up with water, I, I don't know if it comes to fill up with water, but you, I think you just fill it with regular water, and then you put it in the packet, but when they squeeze and that water shoots up your fucking ass, it's quite the fucking experience, and then you immediately have to shit it all out, I had to do it, like, two or three times, and then I still, after all that, when I was on the surgery table, my mom said I shit on the table. <laughs> there was still, there was still shit in me. I literally shit all over the table. She said. Uh, but yeah, I've got Brendan Lochman by KO in this matchup here. I just PFL knows what they're doing. PFL knows what they're doing, dude. They're feeding, they're feeding Brendan Lochman Marlon Marais, knowing that he's probably going to get a KO. Sense of urgency out of Marlon Marais. Oh, that just chopped his leg off. That'll and that's it. it. I remember growing up, my stepfather, my parents are divorced. They got, I've only ever known them ah, divorced. Damn it. <laughs> but they get, <laughs> but they get along. I hate that for you. There's never, there's never been, I've never even that heard breaks, them argue. That just breaks my fucking heart. <laughs> no, honestly, that breaks my fucking heart. Holy shit. God, damn, damn it. it. <laughs> damn. damn it. Damn it, Angelo. <laughs> Damn it. Does it explain my personality? Damn it, Angelo. Had me, she's an immigrant. She had me at like fucking uh, 20. Damn it. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck, A teen man. mom. God oh, damn it. shit. A teen immigrant mom damn in a divorced family. <laughs> How Fuck. did just you Just work in the corner. Make... Just trying to get Just trying to get by. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I'm just kidding. Mom's very Wait, nice. you just said that about my mom? Yeah, your mom's very nice. I, take, I took it back, so. One time I made a joke about Jacob's mom and he blocked me on social media for a week. Well, my mom's in a wheelchair. <laughs> <laughs> uh, From all the dick. So. Anyway, so I what I was saying was, <laughs> you know, that's that. And anyway, moms have to do all the tough stuff. So, yeah. They do. Congrats to moms. I got my warts removed, um, too. <laughs> that was like the most. Jesus Christ. I mean, these are, I mean, these are and you feel stories. bad for me? And you feel bad I mean, for me? I have warts literally all over. Like, you can see, I don't know if you can see, but there's this one's like, see that's all that scar tissue? Like, right no. there? I assume that was dirt from your butthole. I kind of see it. What's the closest you've ever been to death? You want to know the story? It's actually funny. I was actually thinking about this story today for the most random reason. Okay. I'm listening. Oh, yeah. I forgot you can hear with your headphones on. This is a little bit of a, a long story, but I'll, I'll short it as best I can. Basically, I was like 19, 20 years old. Me and my friend are leaving like Walmart, going back to my house in separate cars. And you know how 20-year-olds are. Everything is competitive. So it's like we're racing to my house, but we're not really racing. Anyway, I knew... And it's like blind. As you enter it from both sides, it's blind. 
So I go through that. Obviously, I've gone through it a million times. I start going down the road. The road's blocked. So I'm like, oh, fuck. If he takes a different way to my house, he's going to beat me to my house. I can't let that fucking happen. So I turn around, and I'm trying to book it the other way. I'm in my, I mean, five-speed, I mean, Honda Civic, just with the top down. I mean, it's middle of summer, beautiful. I they make Honda I, Civics in convertibles? I mean, I have the sunroof. I, it's a sunroof. But, uh, top down. <laughs> top down. Probably listen to TI, <laughs> something like that. And I see him, and we make eye contact. And I'm probably going 30, which is way too fast. And he's coming in this turn, probably doing 30 as well, which doesn't seem like a big deal. But when you're ahead on collision, that's a big deal. We make eye contact, and I have one choice. Either I'm wrecking into him, or I'm cutting it off into the fucking grass. So, boom, cut it off into the grass. Pop, pop, pop. All the dirt, like, flies in my windows because my windows are open. And I'm like, oh, my God, I almost just died. That's not the end of the fucking story. I had hit a guide wire from an electrical line, and the Ooh. electrical line was live, bumping up against my car. And apparently, when you when that's supposed to when that happens, you're not supposed to get out of your car. That's like the worst thing you're supposed to do. But I hear this thing bumping up against my car, so I get out of my car. That's the second time I could have died because apparently, once you get out of the car, you like a lot of people just fucking die by getting shocked by this thing. And we're sitting there, and that electrical wire. Remember, middle of summer. Lit the the <laughs> lit the grass on fire underneath my fucking car. Underneath my car, the the dry grass starts catching on fire, and I'm like, "Fuck this! I'm not losing my fucking car." <laughs> so I get back in my fucking car, and I don't even know if it runs at this point. I don't even I don't know if it's stuck. So now I'm in my car with the grass on fire underneath my fucking car with a live electrical wire bumping into my fucking car. <laughs> Pop the clutch and I fucking rip it out of there and finally get it out of there and survive the entire situation. The field burns up a little bit and it was fucking <laughs> a little insane. Bit. I mean, it was like, it was like boom and then it was like boom and then boom. I mean, back to back to back. And that split decision of me jumping back to my car to save my car from catching on fucking fire. You're welcome, mom and dad. <laughs> <laughs> You're a good storyteller. The, I'm a fantastic driver. And that's not even any bullshit. I, I'm a fantastic driver. When I was a... Because you drive like an old lady. No, I mean, Volkswagen GLI. I got six feet forward and flow. You know what I mean? I, got the I drove it. I, I drove yeah, it. I got Half the drunk. Exhaust. No yeah. problems. You literally, you drove it. We were on the tollway and allegedly we were going 90 miles an hour in second gear and you were like, holy shit, this thing's got some go. So I was waiting for you to get in there and just fucking rip that fucking clutch apart and just start dying laughing because I did have a few drinks. And you got in there and started it and fucking took off. And I was just sitting there like like a, like a proud <laughs> girlfriend, like just like <laughs> the whole time, just like, look at you. Uh, Tiffany's a Texan through and through. I'm from Connecticut my whole life. And then she, my one of my good friends growing up was, he's not a doctor, a PA in Dallas met Tiffany. Tiffany was like, oh, I'm going to be a traveling nurse. I can I can go to Connecticut. There was like five states. And your friend's like, I know a guy with a fucking massive dick. He was to. like, he, yes. <laughs> I was wondering if you're going to be like... That's exactly what happened. You're just typical men with humongous egos. You're like every other pro athlete. I should have kept those kids away from you. Now their little lives are ruined and all you can do is argue about who's the bigger penis. I mean, child. <sighs> Longwanger. Oh. Chris Barnett has no <laughs> takedowns. What are you laughing at? Uh, you're going to ban that person. Come slide loser. Uh. That dude was like, I'm out of here. And then commented 11 more things. Who's the Lurking. loser, right? Lurking. I'm a, let's put it this way. I'm a, this is going to get clipped. I'm a cum slut. And yet you're here watching every single thing I say and do and still commenting on it. One of us is a loser. I'm, I'm, I'm a cum slut. I'm a cum slut. We kept saying, we kept saying, uh, you know, you never bet WMMA. Like, just fucking around. Don't bet women. First of all, Tabitha Ricci fucking clean, paid half oh, my mortgage. Oh. She does. She, she's, uh, she's one of the best looking female. Como vai? For sure. Como vai, Tabitha? Como vai? Honestly, this is the most fun, most fun time of my life. And I've said it before, but the movie Waiting with Ryan Reynolds, everything about that is 100% true. Fucking everything about it. I guarantee you think you're Ryan Reynolds watching that, when the reality is 
I was right at my you're place. Fucking, hey, you're fucking. No, no, hey, no, no, no. Uh, uh, yeah, you're you're uh, uh, Luis uh, uh, Guzman. Uh, 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 you are no. Luis Guzman. At my place, I was the supervisor. I was the cool supervisor. I fucking ran that shit, and I was the fucking man. I really think that you need to ask yourself one simple question. How do you feel about frontal male nudity? <laughs> What the heck? Pretty fucked up, huh? The fucking man. Oh my god, that place was oh, I was a fucking king. Absolutely. You think you're Ryan Reynolds, no, but you're I was the fucking king. You're Luis Guzman. That's you also met my you, you even have half a lisp. That's where I met my girlfriend. I was so I would literally was Ryan. Yeah, 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 yeah. I met my girlfriend there. No, no, fix it. My ex girlfriend. 